depends on your squid kung gaano siya karami. So this time I will put 3 cups. And for final coating, we will put these breadcrumbs. Yan, yeah, two breadcrumbs. So we need uh, 2 cups of this one. Yes, nag-English na ako, di ba? <laughs> Yan, yeah, 2 cups. Itong flour natin na to, titimpla natin siya ng salt. Para lumasa dun sa ating squid. And then yung ating basil lips. Yan, medyo makalat lang talaga. <laughs> Magluluto ko nito. And then yung ating pepper. Ganyan. So, kuha pa ako ng salt. By the way, this garlic and onion and then uh, ginger, yan, means na siya. Gagawa tayo ng pinaka-deep niya or yung ating sausawa, yung ating fried squid. Papakita ko rin sa inyo later after natin mag-fried ng squid. So, ating eggs. 3 eggs to. Ayan, meron pang ano. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, titimplahan ko na siya ng konting, konting, konting salt lang. And then, a little bit of paper. Pe pe sorry, pepper. If may available may if may available nga pala kayong garlic powder or gar granulated garlic pwede niyo pwede kayong maglagay yan sa egg and then do sa ating flour small pot or small pan so kahit ano na medyo malalim para makapaglagay tayo ng enough um, oil to fry our uh, squid. So, kailangan deep fry siya para maganda yung kalabasan and pantay yung pagkaluto ng squid. And then yung nakabalot natin na fry and then yung breadcrumbs. So, this time I will use this um, itong maliit na to na medyo malalim. So, that I can put a generous amount of oil. So, deep Fry natin yung ating squid. So, 
kailangan, before natin nilagay yung ating squid, mahinit na mahinit na yung oil natin. So, while, while waiting na while waiting na uminit na uminit yung ating oil, so, gawin, gawin muna natin yung ating coating. First, dip muna natin yung ating squid sa ating ginawang egg. Egg dip na may timplang, salt, and pepper. And you can put also a garlic powder on your egg para mas malasa. And also on your flour. On your flour. So, after natin madip yan, dyan sa egg, you can put it directly here in our flour. This is the first step, second step, and third step. And the fourth step is for frying the squid. So, after natin mabalot ng flour yung squid, we can put it directly here na. So, this time, diretso na siya dun sa ating frying pan. Okay, I think So, another squid. Para paglagay natin dun sa ating uh, frying pan o dun sa ating nireti na pagpiprituhan ng ating squid, we have enough ano na, squid to fry. Marami namang nabibiling mga squid uh, sa market. Ito kasi yung available na nabili namin na medyo malalapat na malalaki. So, we cut it into, yeah, like that, into pieces. <laughs> cut it into pieces talaga. Siyempre, pabalutan pa siya ng, ano, eh, ng flour eh. So, para lang, ano, um, hindi naman bite size. Much bigger than bite size. Yung pagkat ko. Yeah. Roll, roll, and roll in the breadcrumbs. Yes. And here we go. We can fry it now. We can put now our ready squid to fry. Ready, ready na yung ating squid. And then... Yes. Pagkaganyan means your oil is ano na, ready. Or it's hot. Load natin yung fire natin yes. para hindi siya masunog. Of all our sweet, nilagay ko na siya lahat sa uh, ating egg. Inap lang yung 3x dun sa dami ng squid. So, lahat na to, mapapry natin dun sa ating pan. Ito na yung ating squid. Ayan na pinapry. Hindi pa siya masyadong ito. Second bud. 
squid na maluto yung second batch na nilagay natin. This time naman gagawa tayo ng dip, yung vinegar natin para dun sa ating squid. So, masarap yan. So, ito kailangan natin ng itong gagamitin ko yung first one vinegar. So, nasa sa inyo kung gano'ng karami. konti lang para hindi masyadong maasim. And next natin, Itong ating Nordic Witchy Suning. So, konti lang din. And dun sa ating, so, ating sugar, 2 tablespoon. So, lalagay ko na siya lahat. And, I will get lang spoon para dun sa ating ano, para medyo matuna yung ating And then you can taste it para malaman nyo kung enough na ba sa inyo yung vinegar and yung inyong liquid seasoning or yung inyong sugar. This time I will taste it. And we can put a little bit of water. This one lang. And while boiling, we can put our minced onion. Together with our minced garlic. And the last one is our ginger. So, yan. So, we'll mix, we'll mix it up together. And then we'll wait lang na mag-boil. Nung mag-boil. For the second batch, ito na siya. Fried na yung ating squid. Yes! Here you go. This is so yummy. Together with your vinegar dip. With onion, garlic, and ginger. Yes! Wow! Mag- Mag-turn lang yung kulay niya into a bit light brown. That, that's enough na. And, pang third batch natin. Ang squid natin. So, squid. Thank you for watching. Sana gawin niyo po itong chinair kong luto ng fried squid. And have a blessed day. Bye!